what up guys in today's video we're gonna talk about healthy foods so we're gonna talk about the foods I deem good for losing fat or building muscle or just general healthy foods okay so let's start I'm not gonna overcomplicate this video it's gonna be as simple as possible get a notebook write down these food choices and you can make yourself meal plans for yourself okay let's start there are basically three macronutrients that's first protein second carbs and third is fat right so I'm gonna say what are the best foods in each of those three groups let's start with the most important one protein now protein is basically all meat sources so chicken fish pork beef eggs milk um, whey protein right it's a supplement but still I'm gonna count it whey protein cheese you know if you pick a low fat cheese it also has a ton of protein turkey turkey is an awesome source of protein and basically all meat sources right the second one carbs now you have whole grain breads now it's not gonna hurt you if you use white bread but a healthier option is always to use whole grain or brown rice you know sweet potatoes it's just a healthier option <clears throat> so the carbs are bread rice potatoes all kinds of fruits and vegetables you know fruits and vegetables have carbs in them um, quinoa is a good one oatmeal like I said whole grain options pasta you know white or whole grain pasta what you like it doesn't it's not that serious right now let's go to the fats all kinds of oils you cook with the one I like best and the health and one of the healthiest is olive oil or just any kind of oil you have it contains fat right um, healthy nut butters like peanut butter almond butter cashews you know any kind of nuts like in the butters you know the nuts contain the fat so peanuts cashews you know almonds any kind of nuts unsalted unroasted just raw nuts you can buy um, then you have coconut butter and coconut oil that's a very good healthy option now let's talk about the micronutrients the vitamins and minerals now to get your daily dose of vitamins and minerals you have to eat a ton of fruit and a ton of vegetables so at least three to four portions of fruit and vegetables on a daily basis but if you're like me you don't like vegetables right I hate vegetables I eat them when I have to but uh, not a big enthusiast 
and the way to still get your nutrients in there without eating the vegetables is get a good multivitamin that's what I do I use the animal pack multivitamin from animal nutrition because it's my in my opinion it's one of the best on the market you know seriously it has about 11 big ass fucking pills in there and it's not underdose but it's overdose you know so it basically has everything you will ever need just take one pack a day and you'll get more than you need from every vitamin and mineral out there so if you just can't get in your daily dose of vitamins and minerals get a multivitamin it's gonna help you out tremendously okay now it's also important to get your daily dose of omega 3s right that's basically fish oil you can get that from a lot of seeds flax seeds um, chia seeds but I like to get it from fish oil it also it's also a supplement I use you know you can buy it in pill form or you can buy it in liquid form where you take it with a tablespoon or if you just eat a lot of fish on a weekly basis but then you just have to eat at least two, two to three times a week fish and I don't eat that much that amount of fish per week so I just take a supplement and maybe fish once a week and I'm good right so those are basically the foods I deem okay for creating meal plans now don't forget to drink a ton of water at least four liters of water or for you Americans at least a gallon a minimum a gallon of water a day just plain water right <clears throat> Now every meal should be about 30 40 grams of protein 30 40 grams of carbs and then 20 grams of fat but that's based on your goals right if you're losing fat it's gonna be lower than that if you want to build muscle it may be gonna be a little higher than that and it also basically depends on how many meals you have in a day how much time you have in a day so basically to create a meal plan you have to base it on your own needs if you don't want to go through that hardship of creating a meal plan for yourself you can write me on my email and do online coaching so I'm gonna create you a custom meal plan, a custom workout routine. So you're gonna get to your goals super quickly. Right, so if you need help, contact me on my email address. It's in the description down below. So that's basically the kind of foods you should eat. Now in all reality, it's good to eat these healthy foods most of the time but you can also indulge one, once in a while right it's not gonna hurt you like with cheat days when I diet I like to do six days a week strict healthy foods and one day a week I do a cheat day where I basically eat whatever I want that's how I like to do it you know it keeps my sanity and it's not gonna hurt you to do it once in a while right it's gonna be even beneficial and just like for example if I'm bulking right now guys I stick to my calorie goals but if I want to eat a slice of pizza or if I want to eat an ice cream I'm gonna fucking eat it right no I'm not worried about it because I'm bulking and because I have to eat 3,000 calories I don't have a lot of meals in the day so I have to get that in with 
some unhealthy food right but basically the body if you get two different foods one healthy one unhealthy and they have the same macros basically for your weight loss efforts it's not gonna make a difference because your body just detect the macros but it can't you know detect what if you ate a bad food or a good food but also on the other hand bad unhealthy food does impact your hormones in a different way than healthy food so that's why they always recommend eating healthier food options but sometime once in a while you can still indulge in the foods you love thanks for watching guys i really hope this video helped you out don't forget to like leave a comment and definitely subscribe it helps me out tremendously peace out